It's your boy, Secret the Artist, and this top secret connoisseur. Shh. And we're back with another video. Rock on, dude. <laughs> yeah. I'ma just box up a little, count my chest and get it right, yeah, 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 yo, bitch, you fuck tonight, yeah, yeah, We back, you know, yeah. it's sad still because, yo, sometimes you think people have your best interests to actually see you succeed and win, but sometimes even your own fam could turn on you to make sure to see because they don't want to see you win. It's sad, bro. It's a sad world we in, you know what I'm saying? Parents, like, you know, sometimes... Majority of the time, the past, the trauma that, like, people my age and younger deal with at times is passed on from friggin' generation to generation. You feel me? From parents. Basically, our parents are just basically de de doing exactly what their parents did to us. And it's pretty fucked up because once you try to, because we're, we're the type of generation, if something's bothering us, we're going to talk about it. Right. The way we're supposed to just sit there and take it, pause. Pause. But are we supposed to like? Are we supposed to do that? No. Nah, like you know. No. Like we're the type of generation where we're gonna, if something doesn't seem right to us, we're gonna, we're gonna talk about it. Yep. But nah, these parents parents don't want to talk about it. You start talking some real shit, they and they try to try to try to cancel the conversation. Like you dead ass wrong. The fuck? That's some fucked up ass shit, bro. You know what I'm saying? And. That's why, what kind of gender? What kind of gen? M millennials. That's what we are. No. Millennials or Gen Zs, no, right? We're definitely not Gen Zs. M no, but millennials and Gen Zs, mm -hmm. like we're 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 totally different. We grew up in the friggin', in the era of well, the millennials, myself mm -hmm. and this guy, we grew up in the era of basically seeing the transition from being outside to the internet. Crazy. You know what I'm saying? And big transition. Hmm? Big transition. Big transition in life, right? Yeah. So we were real legit the front runners of that shit, right? And now these parents wanna instill these fucked up practices from like their generation, but yo, they're dead ass wrong. Their practices are fucking wrong. And they try to they don't wanna listen, they don't wanna hear us out, and that's immature, and that's fucked up. You know what I'm saying? When I have kids personally, my kids can come to me for any and everything. There will be no way about it. You you don't feel comfortable with something? Yo, come tell me about it. You feel me? It's pretty fucked up the, the time that we in too, you know what I'm saying? Is I don't know. I don't know what to tell y'all, bro. <laughs> like I wanna say people to do better. You can like this now, stuff. Yeah. Tell people to do better. But then you how sure? can uh yeah. Nah. How, do, how, how can we do better? People don't even see the wrong in themselves first. So with that out of the way, we'll let this later. With that out of the way, it's like, big shout out to my brother. Big shout out to my brother, Young Tory, you know. Banging that song, Fake Love. I don't like fake love, don't be dapping me up I kept the real, there was actually love I know you know that I came for the mud I don't want a party, I came for the buzz She wants some drugs, only came here with buzz I'm already high, I came with a buzz I fly as far like a plane or a dog okay, cool. And I really translate and speaks to like Shit going on right now because there's too much fake love out there If it's not genuine, y'all can keep that and stay the fuck away from me with that bullshit You know, like, man, I don't got time for that shit. You feel me? And it's like, bro, I don't know, bro. Times right now is, like, looking very, very spooky. Do you know? Spooky season. Like, man's like me can't even travel. <laughs> you know? And it's bothering me because, like, yo, man's have shit to do. Man's need to, uh, needs to get away. You know? I need a vacay with like, you know, with the baddest. And yo, y'all know what's fucking crazy right now? I learned more shit on TikTok than I ever fucking learned in school. I've been in school since junior kindergarten, senior kindergarten, 
one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, all the way to 12. That's a waste of years. That's like 14 years of waste of my fucking life. School has not touched me, teach me fuck all. What has school taught me? Absolutely nothing. They taught me how to use probability in the Pythagorean theorem. What the fuck is that? Okay, I'm not gonna lie. There's one when I went to college. I went to college, right? And shout out to my t- shout out to my professor. It was advanced English, and because of her, my speaking is more intellect. Hmm. <laughs> shout out to her. You feel me? But other than that, and my business teacher taught me a lot of shit. Other than that, yeah, that's in college, and I had to pay for that. I had to pay for the semester. That's crazy. Then bro. I dropped out because I realized, yo, you're not teaching me shit. I learned more on TikTok and on YouTube more than I ever learned. Always been intellectual, bro. Come on now. Just that guy, bro. Stop chatting shit. I swear, bro. I just never tried, but yo, really? Yeah. And truly, bro, I was a fucking genius, bro. Yo, the ones I'm like. like Albert Einstein, bro. Uh-huh. Yeah, now. Yo, the one thing I never liked was doing all those tryhards in school. Like, you know, like for me, I'm not gonna lie to you. There was a time where I had, there was a period where I had to sit in the front row just because I'm like, yo, I need to get the fuck out of this bitch. <laughs> mm. I cut out all the shit, all the talking, bro. I had shit in my bag. I'm sitting in the front row of the class. So I don't want no drama. No, like that ass, bro. It was like, it was like, you know, I'd just be there, bro, just for the, for the, for the, you know? For but the it takes life. Bro. Yeah, and then after fucking, what's it called? And after now, when a teacher sees me try, they, they, they have a whole conversation with me. They're like, yo, oh. why are you here? You should be in. And it's just like, you know, it's because like, I take you guys as jokes. Come on. Yeah, now. like, yo, you teachers be there, but y'all can't even, like, properly teach. You guys are teaching off a fucking book that's outdated. You feel me? The teachers be coming to me, talking behind kid, students' backs. What yeah. I'm like, what the fuck? They, hear, hear me out, y'all. Hear me out. The school system is meant to keep us enslaved it's meant to basically what's the word i'm looking for it's basically training you to be a freaking worker basically bro the alarm goes off the alarm goes off in a warehouse as well you're like moving you're moving like cattle at that point you feel me so at at that point us millennials and gen z's learn all of our information off of TikTok and YouTube. We get all our information off of social media. And don't get me wrong, there's some fucking dumbasses that be trying to finesse people and make them pay for your program. Yo, we could find you can find that shit free on YouTube. Google, Google anything that you want, bro, anything you need, you need to learn. learn. Anything you need, you can get it, bro. Google. Yeah, that ass. Google's your best friend. You know what I'm saying? Google's your best friend. You Google to your advantage. You know, I've learned so much about crypto from YouTube and thing. Mans are making bands. I've learned a lot about this is gonna ruffle some this is gonna ruffle some feathers. Hmm. I learned a lot about aliens and reptilians more than the United States government has disclosed to the mass majority. Government. Aliens are real. Government can't even disclose that, bro. They say classified. Uh, classified. Aliens are absolutely real. Okay? Sightings that you've seen in the sky and don't know what it is, and like, oh my gosh, what is that? It's an alien. You know what the fuck it is. It's real. You know what it is. There's extraterrestrial life. Bro, since the 18 whatever, bro, there's been what? aliens. Eight since bro. 1850s. There's been alien sightings. There's been aliens, bro. Like, this shit isn't new, bro. In 1850s, they already have We're flying in 2021, cars. 2021, bro. Come on. In 1850, they already have flying cars. Pardon? They had flying cars in 1850. Outrageous. Imagine what they have, and they not, we just don't know about it. Bro, they had guns when fucking... What's that guy's Christopher name? Columbus. Christopher Columbus was alive, bro. They had guns, bro. They left the land to go... Yo, why are we educating the people? They could go do this shit themselves. <laughs> All right. But like, yo, y'all some need... Some real shit, though. Some real shit. Yeah. Christopher Columbus... 
So that working means for the aliens. Working in cahoots with the aliens. Crazy. So like, right now I seen on TikTok that there's an alien. There's aliens that have touched down in Los Angeles. I swear we just watched a movie on this about the reptilians invading. It's crazy. They have a whole entire invasion plan in the freaking White House about a possible attack from extraterrestrial life. Invade America. U.S. Marines, bro. They They all are trained on this. They all are trained, bro. They all get shown a fucking alien. You know that's why the sub get taken out guys, stretchers. That's why they're that's why that's why they're so fucking up because like they realize what's happening. What's, what's really what? What's really what? And then after they realize what they're really fighting for. Absolutely. It's crazy. Like, I don't want to go too deep into yeah. the rabbit hole because I don't want like a gray to pop up, Mister Black, <laughs> and like you like know. Wife, I swear <laughs> with the- this is called a neuralizer. It's a gift from some friends from out of town. This red eye here will isolate the electronic impulses in your brains, and more specifically, the ones for memory. You're looking for lies right here. Who are you? Really? Really? I am just a figment of your imagination. Crazy. And I'd be like, I like pussy. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Cause yo, right now the world is changing right before our eyes, and like everybody, all these, everybody is trying to give an opinion on the net, but on reality, your opinion doesn't matter. Harsh reality of what it is, your opinion does not matter. <sighs> That's a deep one, bro. Yeah. Because we think we have a say. They make it seem as if we have a say. Make it feel like it. That what we're saying is right. But yeah. nah. Okay, so let me address this to y'all then. Okay. All the friggin' black folks, African Americans, just black people in general. Getting killed by the police. Okay, hear me out. The police's mass majority in the in office is white. Police force, the task force, the the I forget what it is, but like they were created they were created to stop the Panthers. They were created to stop rebellions of the blacks. Hear me out. Y'all can Google this to yourself. The task force w- was created to stop the rebellion of blacks, right? If everyone realizes and stops freaking parading in the streets because they will kill you in the streets, there will be murder in the streets of United uh, United States of America because they're passing congressional laws that allow it to happen. If black people stop parading in the streets, and we all united as one to combat the government, to hit them back with some laws and make them, force them, not even make them, force them to approve these laws like they did with the anti-Asian hate crime. We got a lot more done. Everything is set up and designed away. For me saying this, I don't know if I'm gonna drop this video like that. Cause I have said too much. Yeah. Eh, I have said too much. I, I seen it, bro. Two minutes of just that, bro. It's like shit. Yeah, because like, yo, bro. If people actually understood the power of unity, there would be no government. Yeah, but see, now you're just you just <laughs> can't be saying all this shit, bro. <laughs> it's already too much. Yeah, uh, if people understood the power of unity, there would be no there would be no government. There would be no power. What power do they have over you? Look, you know what you gotta do for this video. You know, without power, what do they? What kind of power do they have? Let's say, let's say, because basically, the every single day person, the every regular person that's here, right? We are working to pay the debt for the country. Don't let that go over your fucking head. 
we paid taxes to pay the country. What if no one paid taxes? No one, no one worked. Let's say, this during this pandemic, we said, "Yo, fuck y'all." They're gonna take everybody's house. You're gonna take everyone. You're gonna take everyone. Um, you're gonna you're gonna stop everyone. Nah, that's when we purge. I'm gonna leave it there because I know what I want to say next, but I'm not gonna say it. Yeah, bro. Hmm? Yeah, bro. <laughs> oh, nah, but the movie Purge is crazy. Like, mm -hmm. bro. like what are they telling us, bro? Because like, now I think about it, bro. Like all these movies we be watching, yo, they all be like, you know, leading up to something real, bro. It's yeah. Crazy. Like they all have a meaning behind it. Yeah. Everything. Everything we watch. Absolutely. Holy shit, it's crazy stuff. But who's the mass? See, we're going too deep, bro. Who's the mass friggin' who control mm, I know, the I know, networks? I know, I know. The big three. AT&T. There's like big telecom. It's like, you know, they control the whole entire narrative of everything we see. Fox News is the only real news station that I have seen thus far where they give real life opinions and the guys, sometimes they may not be right, but then that's how you know, like, it's an honest and very in the moment point of view. Mm. Oh, well, God, I don't even know if I'm going to drop this hot talks because mm. yo, man said too much. I feel like I've been here for a minute. Mm. Yo, every time I realize, you know, when man's bottled up, you know, man's bottled for like 20 minutes to a half hour. Crazy stuff. Every single time I record, right? Every single time I record, and I realize, yo, Maz do, Maz doing a video, and then I realize, yo, legit, legitness, legitness, Maz are balling off for thirty minutes. It takes you thirty minutes to smoke no, with your man. life. That's fucked up. Like every time I'm balling up, I feel like a. Phew. That's the way. Whoa. In space. And I'm gone and I'm back. <laughs> and I, I'm back again. Yo, you know the fuck the most fucked up thing is is when you smoke the wrong pack. Yeah. Let's say you smoke a friggin' uh, indica, but you should have been smoking sativa, mm -hmm. cause you know indica will fuck you up and give you that that feeling of like you're drowsy. Mm -hmm. Like yo, bro, right now I might be done for the day. Hmm. <laughs> Hmm. How joke is that? I got some new music out of the way. <laughs> Don't tell new music on the way. New videos on the way. New, new everything. They say like you. This is the new you. Hmm. This is high school. Hmm. I'm the man on the moon feeling like a Michael. They look at me like life goes, that's how life goes. They seen I'm the GOAT, I'm the grace of all time, but I knew it. Come on, man. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Alright, y'all. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, turn your post notifications. If you guys don't see a next video, <laughs> they got me. Holy shit. JK. That will never happen. JK, JK. JK. But until then, like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications for more videos. Man, just like, no, I'm coming to the camera so I can talk to y'all, bro. <laughs> okay? Man's gonna be dropping videos, like skits. It's gonna be funny as fuck. Man's gonna be dropping everything. everything. So if you guys don't see me, it means I'm working. I'm talking less, I'm doing more. This is a positive message for the rest of the day. Have you hope you guys have an excellent day, you feel me? Have a nice life. Enjoy your life. In this. this is getting kind of awkward. Mm -hmm. I'm out. Peace. Let's go. This ain't no, no, this ain't like you. They ain't saying I change cause this ain't high school. I'm the man on the moon feeling like a Michael. They look at me like life.